Okay, what's up guys? Um Hacker Cop 188 here and in today's um screen recording video I am going to show you now this is unbelievable. This is absolutely crazy. But now tell me if I'm wrong, but you can use PokeGen. I'll show you proof in a minute. PokeGen. Yeah, pretty self-explanatory, basically, but I will explain it anyway. Basically, we all we ha we all use Pokey Save Editor in the past. It's pretty it's pretty easy how to to do all that. Now, now here's now here's the kicker. Okay, you don't need. A computer you don't need a PC you don't need root it's all on your phone and all you need is a ROM an emulator to run it on I don't have drastic but I have free DS for Android 6 I have that and this is a really simple easy method I am going to put the link down in the description box below and it's really easy and simple as you can see here I'm going to zoom in just a little bit I have named well actually not named but I have made a Charmander pretty pretty basic if you ask me just a you know just normal Charmander now you must be wondering now, Hacker Cop, how how you do this? Like I I thought you need root to do this. No no, hold on a second. You don't need root at all to do this. It's really easy and simple. Okay, and I'm gonna. It it, it has to do with renaming your save file. If you if you already have one, you have to rename the save file. And as you can see, it's pretty simple now. Now I already downloaded my save file. It's it's not a Pokemon file. It's not. It, it's usually it, it would say PKM file, but yeah, really hard for me to explain. Obviously, but once once I get this tutorial going, you're going to understand how it works. And you'll be able to do this on any Android or iOS device. And it's really simple. So you're going to go ahead, once you made your Pokemon, you're going to download. You can click download. As you can see, I already downloaded it. That's all. That's for step one. You completed step one. Congratulations. Step two. You're going to go to your 7-zipper or Z-archiver. Okay. Really simple, really easy, like I said. And also make sure, so like if you are editing uh, a Pokemon and you're going to edit it to a Pokemon Platinum ROM, for example, like I am doing their 7 Zephyr, you're going to go to that. So like I was saying before, if you're using... If you're using, I don't know, I don't even know, I don't know what I'm talking about. There it is. So, Platinum to save, what you're going to do is you're going to take the ROM. No, I, I don't have to explain it. Really, it, it's simple. It's, it's easy. It's simple once you know what, what the hell you're doing. It's, it's, it's simple and easy. I don't know, what am I doing? Okay, alright. Copy the ROM name, everything but the dot and yes. You can get this at romscode.com. It used to be called ROMs Mania, but they renamed it like a few days ago. You're going to copy. Accidentally exited out of 7 zipper. that's okay. It copied anyway. 
we're gonna go to save now here's now you have to now basically it's really simple this this part right here is simple a DSV file is pretty much similar or the same as a save file so you're going to delete this whole entire thing you're going to delete the whole entire thing right here paste put dot dsv at the end of it now find there you go we found it you are going to copy I highly recommend you copy it so that way you can get a backup you can get yourself a backup of what the heck you're even doing because this this exploit that I've discovered is amazing go to backup and uh, I'm Just go ahead and click OK. And that's all you need to do. Okay. So now, you're going to go to your emulator. It can be Drastic. It can be FreeDS for Android 6. It doesn't matter. It works for Drastic as well. My friend tested it. It works for Drastic as well. Takes a while for the emulator to load. If it doesn't load... What you might have to do is close the tab and reopen it. That's not a problem. FreeDS for Android 6. Yeah, the CPU Studio made this. It really, you really got to shout them out because they did really good. It did a bang up job with this. So what you're gonna do? I have a list of ROMs here. You're gonna find your Pokemon Platinum ROM, and then once you find it, you are going to click on Start Over. If you click on a save state, it will not work. I'm telling you this right now. If you click on a save state, it will not work. And I'm going to lower my volume because it is going to it is going to block out my voice if I don't lower the volume. Press start or press the button. There it is. There's the save to press A. You are going to go to your PC box. It's a little bit laggy. Because this is a crappy phone I'm doing it on, but that's okay. Because you can do it on any Android phone. It can be, it can even be the crappiest Android phone. You can, you can do it on KitKat. That, that's how. It, and there it is. There's our Charmander that I've showed you before. I've made it to to where it has Pokeros. I made it to where it's holding an Admin Orb. I give it an admin nature. I now the the route twenty the route two hundred one egg thing that's incorrect. I screwed something up with that. Um, and there you can see same move set, same just the same exact thing. It's crazy. You're you're doing Poke Gen on your Android device. Gen four and Usually with it now, usually have to download something. You don't have to do anything. The only thing you have to download is the save file, and that's it. It's that simple. Okay, it's that simple. It really, it really is. It really is simple. I'm telling you, it really, it's, it is super simple. And um, you know, there you have it. I don't know why the OT is different. I don't know about that, but there you have it. That is the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, my, I have not been uploading. I will try to upload more often. And uh, 
But thank you guys so much for watching anyway. Your mind has been blown tonight or today or whenever you are watching this video. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to cut the recording out right now. So thank you guys so much for watching. And please share this video with your friends. The link to the website will be in the description. Okay. So make sure you click on the link in the description box below. If I forget to put it in the description, please comment. Okay. And comment and like and do all that for me. Thank you guys for watching.